still having problems on my sinuses. I'm back to smoking cigarettes again. Haters want to hate. Hi guys, how are you doing today? My name is Kidney J. The J stands for jerk because my kidneys are a pair of jerks. And that is Pink Fairy telling us she's gonna smoke, smoke, smoke if she wants to. I guess she's doing like a Taylor Swift like take on when she was saying haters gonna hate, 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 whatever. But this is a Pink Fairy video as you can see. She's in the car. So we get a little car soliloquy, if you will, from Pink Fairy. Tim does show up later with some treats. I put that in as well. Um, so this one is called Got Things to Talk About With You slash slash mobile home living slash slash vlog. And yes, there she just confessed she is smoking cigarettes again. We'll get into all of that as well. How long, how much, she doesn't tell us how much, but you know, She'll give us the general gist of it, I guess. Um, before I do get started, you guys know the drill. Hit the like. Inhale on that subscribe button if you want. And exhale a comment out if you want. So let's go. Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back to my channel. I'm here. We, we come right into town to go to, uh, we came to save a lot. We need it. We need to pick up some milk and eggs. Made some keto biscuits in keto gravy this morning. The biscuits taste good, but the gravy didn't turn out so well. I think it's because I didn't get no heavy whipping cream. Um, we're going over to my sister's for dinner tonight. We're going to have some ham and she's going to make mac and cheese. And I'm going to have salad and a piece of ham. So that will be her dinner, ham and salad. I don't know. We saw her the other video, which I'll link up below, where she had this carb-laden, sugar-laden <sighs> concoction of um, sugar, brown sugar, um, beans, canned beans that are full of sugar um, with some ground chicken. And she had mac and cheese on the side of that. I thought got me a sugar-free... Um, iced coffee, French vanilla iced coffee, sugar free. Mm, that's so good. I used to drink this all the time, but I've been getting one just once in a while here lately. You know, it's sugar. It's still it's sugar free, but it's still sugar. I know this. I get this. I got this. <laughs> Eek. Does she get it? Does she got it? Okay, I'm not gonna get into like the dangers or the research of, um, you know, aspartame and all the sugar substitutes, but I don't think she understands that something like a Diet Coke is, yes, it's sugar-free, calorie-free, carb-free. That's okay. It probably won't spike your blood sugar. Now I'm not talking over time and lots and lots of Diet Coke, not gonna get into that. But if she were to have say a cookie or a bun that were labeled quote unquote sugar free, that just means there's no added sugar or they added a sugar substitute, but there's still carbs. You still get the refined carbs from the flour, whatever flour they're using, unless it's like a nut flour. Um, it's still gonna spike her blood sugar. So I don't think she quite gets that. Sorry, I don't have a PO box. People message me and ask me, or email me. Haters wanna hate, hate, hate. And that's about it. So yeah, that's what we're doing, it's 55 out. Right now it's supposed to hit 60 today. Or it might even be up. I haven't checked the weather. And I haven't checked the temperature in a little bit, so. Why do you need to check the temperature? You're outside. You're in your car. <laughs> Roll down the window, girl. Might be warmer or not by now. I go to doctor next month. So, I gotta do all that. I go every month. No, not every month, sorry. Scratch out every six months. Oh, gosh. Every three months. I go and I have all my blood work done and all that every three months. 
So I actually check out my sugar numbers and all that every three months. Oh, what a pause. Um, so I think, and I'm just guessing here, I have a feeling he's getting monthly blood work and maybe seeing the doctor every three months. Only because um, since Christmas, she's talked about her A1C, getting it lower um, a few times. I think he's probably been told monthly blood work because we need to monitor you. Especially since you're on not one, but two medications to control your diabetes. We want to see if they're working. Um... So we're going to, you know, keep close tabs on you as well as three months seeing the doctor just goes to show me that her diabetes is not under control right now, not where the doctor wants it. Um, usually if you're coasting and you're doing well, you don't have to see the doctor that often. Um, to put it in perspective for you, if I were to um, do my dialysis at home I would see a doctor once a month and I get blood work once a month um, because I have a in-center treatment I see a doctor once a week and we get blood work once a month so it's um and if something were to go wrong with my blood work I would have it repeated the next day so I have a feeling that she's probably getting month monthly uh blood work or was told to oh we're tired I want to do something with my hair. I want to get my hair cut and do something with it, but I don't know what yet. But I don't want it too short because I don't like it too short on my face. <laughs> so I have problems on my side. Get a wolf cut. Get a wolf cut. Cut. They're so fashionable right now. Can you see Pink Fairy like rocking like shaggy layered like wolf cut? Do it, girl. Do it. Minus is back to smoking cigarettes again. I quit for about three months. So, you know, so I'm working on that again. Oh boy. Okay, so type 2 diabetes and smoking, deadly combination. Um, not only smoking, you know, puts you at risk of cardiovascular events, so does type 2 diabetes. Um, but nicotine actually changes cells so they don't respond to insulin and it can increase your blood sugar. So not only is she fighting uh, like her own body and her own diet. She's also adding cigarettes to the mix. By the way, I got that from the CDC website. Um, I will link that down below if you want to read on that. Um, and she stopped for three months. That's it. She's been diagnosed with type 2 diabetes for almost a year now, and she only stopped for three months. Also, I want to know what led her to start again. Or did she not fully quit? Maybe she weaned herself down to like one cigarette a day and now she's back up to however much she smoked before. Girl, what are you doing to your body? Let's work on all my eating. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I said, I'm at 317. My weight's at 317. Up from 400. That it was a few years ago, but I just can't get past that 317. I gotta eat and work harder and eat way less. Um, I guess she went down from three. She was 400 a year ago and now she's down to 317. I guess she's plateaued at 317. I don't get these plateau people. I don't get when you're 300, 400, 500 pounds, how you plateau at that weight. Like what are you eating truly? Also, I have, okay, I have a little hard time here with her complaining about ugh, all the stuff she has to do. Girl, just do it because if you don't, it's going to get a lot harder, a lot harder. If your kidneys fail, you are going to be on the strictest diet you have ever been on your life, in your life, and it is going to be life or death. Um, you know, keep going around with your A1C at 8, 9, 10. You're going to lose vision how life will be. For you then, mm, you'll be looking at these times being, damn, my life was good back then. If only I had appreciated it then. And I'll get there. I think it's summer would do good a lot better because we're going to have a garden. So we're going to be out gardening a lot and doing all that. And hopefully the summer's not as hot. Don't wait for the summer. You, know, you see, 
hopefully, we haven't decided yet if we're going to get a new pool or not. Um, or just go over to my sister's and swim. Cause Do she's it. Got the in-ground pool. Here comes Tim. He's got the eggs in the milk. Tim, he's got the eggs in the milk. Okay, I did a pink Farinese alert there. Stand down, embassy people, because re <laughs> watching it back, now I hear... Uh, I hear what she said. Tim has the eggs and the milk. But she was talking about pools. So it was totally out of context. Play it one more time. Tim, he's got the eggs and, and the milk. milk. Now I get it. Tim. Oh, he got some. Oreo cocktails. Oreo cocktails. Never seen them before. Ooh, Oreo cocktails. Oh, Tim, Tim, Tim. What are you doing? You were supposed to get eggs and milk and you come back with that. Now she knows, even though she hasn't learned a lot, she knows that is pure sugar. I don't think I've ever seen them before either. How they taste? Not like Oreo. Doesn't. No, oh, it does have white cream in the middle. Mm -hmm. That's supposed to be white cream in the Oreo and then this. I ain't gonna leave one. I just want to taste one. I, I love Oreo cookies and milk. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, that's it for this one. We'll get caught up again with Pink Fairy this week, probably. Oh, it tells me she's learned nothing. Um, not, I don't know. <laughs> she needs to go see the dietitian, the diabetes dietitian that she confessed last week she hasn't actually spoken to. And she'll know the difference um, between sugar-free, carb-free, keto. She'll learn all those things and the effects of her her blood sugar. Thank you guys. I appreciate your eyes and ears and we'll talk to you later. Bye now.